Hi, I'm Chris, and I'd like to welcome you to Faith Elements, where I, I like to explore some of the elements of the Christian faith. And uh, on this edition, we're actually kind of in the field here. I'm in an, an apartment complex that was ransacked here in Troutwood, Ohio, on the uh, Memorial Day uh, tornadoes. And I don't know if you can hear the silence, but there is nobody living in these apartments anymore. And these uh, it's a rather large apartment complex, and it is completely empty now. Something about an empty house, an empty dwelling, always kind of gets to me. Uh, you know, there's, a, there's a, a place that was built for a purpose, and that purpose is not being fulfilled now. And there's a part of me that just always gets a little bit heartbroken when I see that happening. And to see that happen on this scale, you know, these are hundreds of apartments. I forget how many people uh, live down here, but hundreds of apartments, and they're now empty. They're now... I don't want to say pointless. They are serving as a reminder of what happened on Memorial Day, but they're not fulfilling their intended purpose. And I always bring that back to me. Am I fulfilling my intended purpose? And and maybe you would ask that question of yourself. And we can tend to feel like we're not fulfilling the purpose that we've been made for. But I want to read something for for you here. This is from Colossians 1.16, and it says, For in him... <laughs> let, me, let me see if I can read. For in him all things were created, things in heaven and on earth, visible and invisible, whether thrones or powers or rulers or authority, all things have been created through him and for him. Today, my prayer for you, if you're watching this, I just pray, I ask you to hit, you know, make a comment down below or something so I know who to pray for. If you're feeling like an abandoned apartment complex, that you don't have a purpose, I want you to know that, uh, you know, God wanted to change the world and he created you and he put you here. He had a need and I don't want you to ever feel like an empty apartment or an empty house that, you know, you exist but what is on the inside is not doing its job, I want you to know that there is biblical proof that you have a purpose and a reason. And uh, I don't want you to ever feel alone in that. We can all go in those places where we go, ah, you know, I just, I'm just breathing air, I'm just existing. But we, uh, we do have a purpose, and I hope you know that, and I hope you'll feel that and receive that from me today. So thanks for joining me here in Trotwood, Ohio, on this uh, special field edition of Faith Elements. And uh, I just hope you're well and blessed. Take care.